I'm a flirt. Soon as I see her walk up in the club, I'm a flirt. Winking eyes at me when I pull up on them dubs, I'm a flirt. Sometimes. I'm What's up Diamond Squad? It's your girl Sanaya Diamonds here and I'm back again with another video. If this is the first time you see my face on your screen, make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button, smash the like button, turn the bell notification on so you miss anything that I post and last not least be a part of Diamond Squad. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how I achieve this eyeshadow look, this whole look. I don't even know what to call this look honestly y'all. I really don't. But I'm gonna show you guys how I did that. I was just playing around with makeup, you know. I really wanted to do like a blue eyeshadow look, and this is what I came up with. So, yeah, I'm just gonna do one side of the face to show you guys how I got the look. And I'm gonna also take this off because I want to show you guys like what lipsticks, what lipstick palette I use, and all that stuff, etc. Et right, guys, so this side is gone. Everything in my lips, so I, it looks like I have pink lipstick on but i have no pink lipstick on y'all i don't know why looks like that so yeah so first off i'm going to start off with my bh cosmetics take me to brazil palette and i'm going to use this color first and by the way, I didn't um, put any concealer. This is how I did it basically to get that look. Before I forget, let me put some tape. Okay, got it. Put some tape right there. All right. Now, alright, so I zoomed in so it's up close and personal. My, my eyes are just looking weird right now, but like I said, I'm gonna go into this, um, I don't know, that color right there and just put it on my crease. And for some reason, it looks green on my crease, I have no idea why. So, anyways, just gonna put that onto the crease and blend it out as much as you can so now with that and I'm I use the same crease brush to create this whole look cuz yeah so anyways um the next color I'm going to go into is this baby blue color. Or you could say sky blue, but I would say baby blue. And just put it on top and blend that out. Once you feel like it's fully blended, then you can stop. I'm going to just blend out a little more. Okay. My eyes is looking like way, way smaller than this eye. I don't know why, but yeah. Um, next, I'm gonna go into this shade right here, and I'm just gonna once again put that over on the crease. We want to be putting a lot of colors on the crease to get it to look like this side. So, just know that. Alright, after that, I'm going to go ahead and use where is it? this color, um, this kind of like a midnight shimmery color. So, we're going to just go ahead and put that onto the crease as well. So, you're basically laying in the crease with, you know, these colors, making it pop. Alright, and once you feel like you had enough, and I put like a little bit too much up here, so I'll, after I'm done, I'm gonna clean that up. So, yeah. Next, I'm gonna use is this shade right here. And just once again go over it. Just 
and then that's enough now before i get to like the other parts of the eyeshadow look i'm gonna just clean up some of the areas that i put so i took off the product where i don't want it to be and let me just clean this side up all right now i'm done with this now I'm just gonna take some concealer and do a so I'm just taking my concealer brush and then gonna do that cut crease. Yeah, I'm a little bit sick. Like my allergies acting up early. Like it's not even allergy season yet. And my allergies open up early. This always happens. Like my allergies always come early before allergy season even comes. Like it's ridiculous. Alright, after I do that, I my wild palette, and I'm going to use this blue color right here that's called Off Beat, and I'm just going to put that where I put the concealer basically, um, I'm not going to put any setting powder to set my eyes, anything like that, because honestly, I didn't do that, that's how I created this, like, this bold look, so just going to go in there. Just put that color on there. Just, just like that. And I'm just going to keep adding it onto there until I get like the amount that I want on my lids. And here too. Alright, so as I get the amount on my lids, well, I feel like I could have put this a little bit higher. Hang on, guys. The crease color is kind of not showing a bit, so I just need to have it shown a bit more than that. Alright, now what I'm basically going to do is take concealer again and just... I don't really know what it's called, but... I just do like a line across this line is so freaking hard to do y'all like Like, as you doing this, you need to, like, take your time because you don't want. Okay, like, the areas that I missed spot, I'm just going to put the blue there. So, I fix that now. Now I'm going to just take my, um, what is this brush called? My e.l.f. Defining Eye Brush. And I'm just going to use this color right here, Rebellion. It's white in a pan, but it's like gold once you like blend it in and all that stuff. So, I'm just going to put that where I put the concealer.
don't know why it's not coming out the same way like this. Like, I hate when, um, when I come up with a look and it doesn't come out the way it's supposed to. I don't know, probably because of the way my eye is right now, that's why it's looking like that, but that's how I did it. Basically, I uh, created this whole look. Alright, I'm gonna just take that crease color again and just like blend it in here because like I feel like that is like missing so much all right guys um i'm gonna take that same color i used for like you know the line thingy and i'm gonna just go ahead and put that in my inner corners just like i don't know if y'all could see that but hopefully when i zoom in y'all see it but i just go like that and then i'm gonna take Storm or so. I don't know if you can see that in the zoom, but storm. And I'm just going to go ahead and place that on top. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and put some eyeliner on, some mascara, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, I basically did it. For some reason, this side looks a bit off, but it's the same exact thing that I did to achieve this eye. So, yeah, I'm going to just retouch up on my highlight. So, for the highlighter, I used my Unicorn Glow Palette. And I used the blue highlighter, of course. And I'm just going to retouch up that on my face because all my highlight got off my face. Now for my eyebrows, since that blue is just stuck there, I'm going to just highlight under my brows with this concealer real quick. Just going to do that. And then I'm going to take my liquid, um... Highlighter from Clean Color. And I know I should probably like dry this down, but it's that's how I just did it for today. So I probably should have. Now it looks so bad. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, guys, I kind of fixed it a little bit. It looks way better than it was looking before so yeah let me just quickly close my foundation because like yeah I have to like literally like retouch on my foundation to like get this looking right and yeah but that's basically how I did the eyeshadow look now for the lips for the lips, I just use my Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick palette. And for the first color I used was like this brown shade right here. And I'm just gonna like put that all over my lips. Alright, the next color that I use is um this like dark plum type shade. And I just put that in the center. Just in the center like that.
and then what i also do is i take like this really like nude shade and i just put that in the center as well so there you go that's all i do for the lips and also the last thing i do for the lips i go back into my highlight palette and i use this highlight shade right here this one and i just highlight like on top of my lips right here since i didn't do that first because usually you're supposed to do that first but it don't really matter voila that's it that's how i created this whole look i didn't really like the lip color too much with this i was gonna use the a dark the dark blue that's in here and then put like the whitish gold in the middle but then again i don't really like to put like the same i don't like to really put the similar eye um the similar lip color that smashed the eyeshadow look sometimes it's like good to like use a different color black lipstick will also go with this as well but yeah guys so my highlight i don't know what's going on right here but yeah let me know what y'all think about this look and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video give this video a like comment down below subscribe if you're new click the bell notification if you haven't follow me on my social media it's in the description box down below and if you want to do collaboration with me, my email is in the description box. You can email me or DM me on Instagram. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.